Hello Aries, this is Gypsy Spirit here with you and I'm ready to give you your tarot reading. Uh, we are, um, I'm actually giving you a four day forecast here. Uh, September 21st through the 24th. I'm going to be a little tied up through Tuesday, so I thought I'd uh, give you four days. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, this is the High Priestess in reverse here. Something tells me you're not listening. Uh, what's wrong, Aries? How come you're not listening to your higher divine? You've kind of turned your back on it. Um, you know, that little voice that comes and talks to you, uh, and, and you hear that voice, and, and we, when we tend to ignore it, it is because um, we have tuned out, and we're more trapped into the world, into the worldly ways, and, and the conditions or the things of this world, thoughts, behaviors, beliefs, that we have been conditioned to while we're on this planet. But when the High Priestess shows up and she's trying to give you some help and you're not listening to her, you're not following your uh, true authentic self, um, your purpose, why you're supposed, what you're supposed to be doing. And which leads us into the next card, my dear, which is the Nine of Wands here, and it's in reverse. So I, I feel like this has to do with work, money, um, because I, I, I'm, I'll tell you about your next card, but right now, so the Nine of Wands being in reverse is telling me that, um, you know, there's something that you're working on and you're not getting the clarity that you need to, to follow through. Um, you're, you're trying to make it, Whatever it is, it, for some some of you it might be a promotion, I feel. But you're trying to um, move forward with something. And it's not working for you. It's it's not happening. The reason why it's not happening is because you're not listening to your higher priestess. So, the high priestess. <laughs> you're more, you're stuck. You're stuck somewhere. So you got to open up a little bit and, and get yourself out of this fucked up world that we live in for a few minutes and listen, uh, meditate, and listen to your high priestess because your high priestess is the one that has a blueprint of your life. And she is the one that knows best. We're also on a full moon right now. So now is a good time for you to, to you know really tap in with that full moon and ask, you know, communicate, get rid of the junk that you no longer need, that, that's not helping you. See, we're conditioned to things of this world. From the time we're born, it could be something that's passed on to us from parents or grandparents on down the line. But, um, and, and we get so uh, conditioned to the ways of this world and so you're being called with this nine of wands being in reverse. And I, you feel like you keep going around and around in circles with like a chicken with your head cut off. Um, it's because you, you, you can't, you're not, you're not able to think out of the box yet. Uh, but when you start listening to your high priestess, start meditating and remove yourself all out of the, the conditions of this world. Uh, things that you've been conditioned to all your life, your thoughts, beliefs, behaviors. Uh, remove yourself away from that, um, and you'll start to get some clarity. That And that's that's what you want. And I do have good news for you. <laughs> Maybe you're going to listen to me after all. <laughs> because come around Tuesday, I believe, um, we got the Page of Pentacles. Look at that. Uh, look at that rainbow and those fairies. Um, around there and, and the happiness pentacles is about money so you've been working uh, trying to figure something out uh, not able to get some clarity and I feel like um, you are going to start uh, uh, probably by Tuesday or the middle of the week you know working with this full moon is just really tough um, and I gotta tell you I've been doing some um some full moon candle magic rituals and uh, Mahatma guided uh, energy meditation with my clients. I've done about six or seven of them this week. And oh my God, the transformation that I've seen people just 
in a matter of 30 minutes with candle um, moon ritual. It's just been amazing. But anyway, back to your story. I do believe, Aries, that you are going to end up listening uh, and start um, breaking away from, from some of the conditions uh, that you're thinking about in regards to this work. Um, trying to step out of the box and, and think more clearly. And, and we do see this with the page, the page of pentacles, because it's like, it, it, it's um, something that's very familiar to you, you know, this way of making money or this new thing, but it's, it's a little familiar, but it's also something kind of new that you've never done before. So you're excited. You're going to get excited about it. Um, it it's, uh, it, it's going to bring uh, some more uh, good energy to you, but uh, it's going to also help you with some more clarity uh, to really get where you want to go. So even though, like right now, this weekend, it, it's, it's feeling kind of gloomy for you a little bit, um, you got to, you know, like I said, listen to that higher divine. And, and it's going to get a lot better. So just hang in there. Keep working at it. And don't give up. Just take some time to meditate and clear out what you don't need. Uh, I, I think for some of you, maybe, you know, a day or two of some R&R &R might be good for you as well. So anyway, I hope you like this video. Um, this is Gypsy Spirit here with you. Uh, if this does not resonate with you, it's okay. Um, it, then it wasn't meant for you to hear. But if you want your own personal reading, you can go to the box below if you're on um YouTube. And also, if you're on YouTube, if you like this video, hit the like button and uh, hit the subscribe button so you'll get a, a notice every time I put a video out, which I try to do about every day. And uh, hey, you know, if you're on TikTok or uh, what's the other one? Instagram. <laughs> uh, follow me. Uh, you'll get something from me every day. So I hope to see you soon and I will talk to you again. Have a great weekend. Bye bye.